Hello and welcome to Merseyside's newest station. Headbolt Lane opened about eight months ago now. Um, back in October 2023, it's now June 2024. Um, I wasn't gonna do a video, uh, but I've got an hour and a half here, which I'll explain more in a minute. But first, welcome to Flights and Times. So why have I got an hour and a half at Headbolt Lane? Because Northern have cancelled the train. So I was about to have half an hour here. Um, I'm on a two day rail day essentially. Uh, I've come up to this way from Peterborough this morning heading up to Carlisle overnight. Um, so yeah, I'm going from here to Wigan, Wigan to Carlisle. So yeah, uh, I was due to get a Northern service. Uh, they've cancelled that so I've got basically an hour and a half till the next one. I've uh, just arrived on that treble seven. Um, but yeah, so Headbolt Lane, three platforms, two here. Uh, platforms one and two are for Merseyrail. Platform three over there, which we'll go to later, is for the Northern services. And essentially Headbolt Lane is, it now serves North Kirby, um, but it replaces Kirby as the terminus for both Merseyrail and Northern. Uh, they used to be the end of the line under the bridge at Kirby. It's now here um, But yeah, so I'll tell you a bit more about the trouble sevens and we'll have a look around what else is here at Headbolt Lane So Mersey Rail's fleet is now mainly made up of class treble sevens. Uh, they're replacing the 507s and 508s The latter of which are now completely gone uh, And these are powered by third rail um, as were the 507s and 508s the issue is here at Headbolt Lane is that the third rail ends one station that way at Kirby. So how do we get here? Well, seven of the class treble sevens, uh, there's a lot of sevens there, have batteries on board. Uh, so the batteries charge all the time they are on third rail. And then between Kirby, Headbolt Lane and back to Kirby, they run on battery power. So if you see treble seven and then one XX rather than zero XX, those seven are the ones with batteries. They also say batteries on board on the side of them. Um, but yeah, uh, gonna show you platform three uh, and then we'll be jumping on Northern service uh, over to the Wigan. So I'm gonna be quite quick because there's gonna be a train arriving in platform two in a minute and I'm gonna get swamped by all the people getting off that train. But yeah, I've come to the end of platforms one and two. Uh, there's a connecting bit here, platform three is just there. Um, what is there at Headbolt Lane? We've got ticket office, uh, waiting shelter, uh, big bike shed, another little waiting shelter further up on platform one and one on platform two, similar on platform three, but that's it. Um, got ticket machines and all that, but there's no shop, no um, cafe, no vending machines, etc. Um, yeah, that's, that's your lot here at Headbolt Lane. So behind me is platform three at Headbolt Lane. It is this platform used by Northern Services. Uh, there's roughly an hourly service between here and Wigan Woolgate and some services going to Blackburn or Manchester. Uh, but yeah, essentially an hour between here and Wigan, with the exception of my service today, which they have cancelled. So I've got an hour and a half's wait. But hey ho, um, the way they've designed Headbolt Lane uh, you've got platforms one and two, the Mersey Rail platforms, just the other side of that fence. You've then got this line, platform line here, and a line behind, which I have no idea what it's for, but has been intriguing me. Uh, but essentially, if they wanted to extend Mersey Rail further that way, out of the city, 
uh, they could remove that middle bit, join up the lines and basically it's been designed with future proofing in mind. Um, I'd be intrigued to see whether the treble 7 uh, slash 1s, battery powered ones, uh, have enough battery power to go further out or whether they'd have to extend the further out uh, but this is all very long term plans uh, nothing in the immediate future certainly uh, nothing in the medium term all very very long term uh, but yeah that's kind of that's it for headbolt lane really um, as I said two Mersey rail platforms northern platform ticket office bike racks not much else so yeah thank you for watching Goodbye.